Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Skull. What can I say? I mean, this game is already hilarious, but I really, really, really love the music in games. I know I just played Shantae, and I'm playing Journey Down, and the music is just so awesome, so sway. Well, I call it sway because you're swaying to it. It's so bouncy, so upbeat, just awesome. Let's, let's get back into the game, and yeah. Now, here's the thing. I know I said I want to do a lot of things myself, and I will. I will do a lot of things myself. But because we're in, uh, I'm into the story, and you guys are into the story, and I wanted to move along, and I don't want to waste too much time, I still, weekying is still not going to be that big of a problem. It does kind of get me a bit, but not as much as I explained that as I did. I just, I absorb uh, in uh, intelligence. I, uh, as, best, as best of my knowledge, I can, uh, if I'm interested, I want to absorb it. So, whatever they point out, I will take in, just like she's just waffling it, her cooking. Um, I, uh, I, I just want to absorb this, this story. Alright, so, what we left off, we got ourselves a mug of coffee. So let's give it to that one, that one, uh, sad lady. Poor guy. He got some watery coffee. I don't drink coffee myself. And uh, double tap. And uh, walk on over. Hey, lady. Would you like some coffee? Guess what your best buddy Buana just got you? Coffee. Shall be praised. Well, technically it's coffee, but you eat it with a spoon. We call it Makina's Volcanic Rock. It makes your belly button burn. Hey, this is awful. But I think it's working. Hey, kid, thanks. I think maybe you just saved me my job. Can I please borrow your maintenance card? Sure, kid. I guess I owe you one. Juan is a good guy. Just don't ask him to deal with your food. <laughs> he paints it, he makes it out of petrol, if that's the name for oil. I think she deserves a break from me, actually. You may be a teaser, you may be on the teasy side, but you have a heart, and that's cool. And you're creative. Just don't touch people's food. <laughs> Alright, now it's time to move on. Card terminal. I already knew this part. Oh no. Oh no. Um. Our uh, maintenance grid. Immediately. I don't know. Oh crap. Looks like I'm in for a puzzle. You hate puzzles. Can you just smash the buttons? Can you smash the button like you did before? Alright. It was her card. I feel like we should at least ask her, because the last thing that I needed uh, uh, on something, I needed to go back to someone already. Hey, do you know the passcode for this maintenance card? Sorry, kid. I don't remember. I know I wrote it down somewhere, though. Oh! Oh, no! Please say it points it out! Please say this. Oh, these container signs sure provide some fun reading. Hanjin Wa Shipping Company LTD HJWCU828198 Max Gross 38,400 kilograms Ta, 2,240 kilograms. Payload, 28,240 kilograms. Cube, 33.1 CBM. Well, it's worth a shot. Hmm. Please, 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 please. Tell him to do this to me. Okay. 
Okay, I just want the. I really just want to see how, see how the story progresses. I'll do any puzzles I know I can do. Let's see. Um. It's an Armando Railway Maintenance Card. Is the number here? Wait, no. It's an Armando Railway Maintenance Card. Eight nine F squish. It's it's. Just, it's an Armando Railway I'm sorry, Maintenance I'm to Card. Ah, come on. It doesn't even stay up long enough, so I don't think it's about that. Hmm. Hmm. She wrote it down somewhere. Oh yeah, she wrote it down somewhere, but because it doesn't stay on the screen for too long, I didn't think it was upon the card. It was on the card. It's an Armando Railway maintenance card. I can't card. point the screen. It's the, the the dots with the line on it is the It's an Armando Railway is the combination right there. I wonder what these funny symbols mean. All right, uh, let's go get this. Let's activate this thing, Bob Bobber. Yes. All right. I gotta stop weakening. You know what? No, I'm gonna weak you if I need to. Forget it. I just want to see this thing progress, and I'll do what I can on my own. Button, button, big buttons. The elevator won't go any further. Ah, there we go. Hmm. There we go. There's one thin elevator. And right next, this is not well built. All trains cancelled, it says. Yeah, funny thing though, ain't it? The trains still keep on zooming by. It makes you wonder what's on board. Hmm. I'm not climbing onto the tracks. That's suicide. I didn't ask you to. It says, think about the environment. Throw your magazine in the trash where it belongs. Nice sign on that trash bin. Thanks. I placed it conveniently right next to the tub. In case, you know, someone in a sudden stroke of clear thinking after purchasing the magazine realizes it'd be better off in the trash. I recycle a lot of magazines that way. It saves me some good money. Yes, it does. Clever. Your job is just to sell the magazine, but you put that there just so... Like, I'll do the job, but these magazines are kind of full of poo poo. So, looks yummy. I tell you, looks can be deceiving, man. The rappers probably got more flavor than the candies themselves. Man, you're not much of a salesman. Hey, we're friends, man. I don't want to rip you off. Besides, you ain't got to worry. I'm not honest when it comes down to real business. What's up, kid? Hey, Bonner, what's up, man? How come I never see your greasy face around here no more? Busy, man. Got a big customer going. <laughs> I bet you have. You high roller, you. So, what's on the TV? Same brilliant entertainment as you on these networks. Now, I'm watching a guy stuff as many socks into his mouth as possible. He's playing genius. I could spend my life watching this stuff. <laughs> Isn't that exactly what you're doing? Say, you're as sharp as they come, one. <laughs> so how's business? This place is getting lonesome, man. Now the trains don't stop here any longer. Ain't nobody come to visit to buy my goods. I got some good goods, you know. Putting the good in the goods. That's what I used to say. Hey, <laughs> sorry, man. I got no reason to come up here. Me and Kito mostly hang around the charter these days. Easy living, you know. Playing it cool in the bay. I hear you, man. The city's a lean, mean place. Nothing for a cool cat as yourself, one. 
I don't know, man. The city has its charms. But I've had my dose of it. Me and Keto grew up on those streets, you know? Doing the hustling, doing a lot of bad things. That's so one. You don't strike me as no hoodlum. Who pulled you out of there? A guy named Kaunan Dodo. The original owner of the Chatter. He busted us when we were breaking into his place down by the bay. <laughs> we thought he was going to kick our faces in right there. Instead, he adopted us on the spot and helped us clean up our act. We owe a lot to old Kaunan Dodo, wherever he is. Man, ain't that a gripping story? You should be on TV. What a nice story. Well, you know, yeah, it's still a nice story. What you selling, man? Magazines and newspapers and all their shapes and sizes. It's all wonderful garbage, though. You know that. Ranging from poo flinging journalism to ultra biased news updates. I'm just hopping it. Hoping some moron will buy a couple papers so I can close up and call it a day. What? You gonna go home and watch TV? Hey, what you guess? How come the trains don't stop here no more, man? How come the trains don't stop here no more? Something about the Armando Power Company taking over and shutting things down. They own the Armando Railway Authority now, too. You heard about that, right? It's all over the newspapers if you're curious. I don't read this drivel I sell, though. I've got TV. See you later, man. Later, Buona. Stay frosty. So what else can I do here? Uh, so I have the access card to get up here. I need... That's all we it's all crooked though. Ah, I think I know, I think I know. That could work, but no way I'm standing on the tracks. Hmm. I'm gonna need something with even more force. This steel is tough. He's not gonna stand on the tracks. Any chance you can bend this in shape? Sorry, man, you barking up the wrong Galapagos tree right there. I couldn't bend so much as a plastic spoon. Maybe I could reach it from below somehow. Oh! <laughs> okay. I can't, I don't know if I can stop it at any point. Not looking like I can press any buttons. Is there any other path I can take? Come on, come on. I gotta I, I, I figure this out. I got to. You want to step on the tracks. That's, that's smart. That's smart of you. The only thing I got here is uh, buttons. The elevator won't go any further. Seems to be locked in place. Hmm. Oh wait, let's go down a little bit more. Oh. <laughs> We're vandalizing. Ah, that's it. The plate is all loose now. Sabotage rocks, man. <laughs> All right, I figured this out. I didn't. I didn't do any of the weaking this time. <laughs> Splash! Ha! It's straight as an arrow, man. I did it, man. I did well, man. All right, let's go, man. We we, we on our way. We on our way. I am proud of myself. How'd I know about that little trick? Well, because I, I watched a movie where someone, a kid, it was on a movie, a kid put chains onto a railroad track. Do not try this. It could, I, I've also heard that it can derail a train and that's even worse. That is bad. But he put, and on the movie, he put down a chain 
The train ran over it. He came back after the train bypassed, picked it up, and the train was flat. The chain was flat. But yeah, yeah, don't tr don't do that. Yeah, here we go. We're on our way. We're on our way, man. Let's put this with this winch on. Let's let's talk to Kito. Let's show this to Kito. Good job, man. I'll just get the engine steadied while you raise the anchor, okay? You just gotta see what he had to say. Gotta hear what he had to say. You can't see what someone has to say unless someone says something uh, visually. Ooh, that looks nasty. There we go. This means we finally ready to get out of here. Good job, Wana. I just got to get these last couple of boats in place. Then we are ready to take off. Finally, the edge awaits. The edge? We going over the edge? Awesome. Forget it, lady. That's suicide. The suicide if you stay. Come up with us. Seriously? We need to get airborne now. Relax, lady. Whoever these guys are, they can't just barge in and... On second thought, let's get out of here! Fly, Iguana! Fly! Shita, get in here! We're taking off! Hold on, I'm almost done! It's working! <laughs> Not the wrench, man! We have an armored tank on our flight! Ooh, that was close! I'm not sure we shook them! They're chasing us! We got to take off! Here goes! Awesome! Cutscene! Do something, Juana! Fly! Don't worry, lady! What? Why? Hold on to your dress! Yeah! Oh, no. We fly in! We made it! You can stop screaming now. Don't worry about him. He has a problem with heights, that's all. You're a pilot and you're afraid of heights? No worry, lady. I'm fine with them as long as I don't see them. See? A lot better. Let me sit like this for a while and I'll be fine. Tell me if I need to turn or something. I can't believe it. My pilot is afraid of heights. <laughs> I gotta hand it to you guys. You did a good job. Wanna air. You'll never find a safer way to fly. I hope she is full to the brim with gas. Of course, lady. Full to the brim with gas. Right, Kito? Right, Buana. Feel tear up, right? I only check for oil. Uh, we might have a problem here. Are you telling me you run a gas station for a living and you forgot to fill the plane with gas before we took off? Look at the gauge, it's full as bananas. Uh oh, full as bananas, you say? A slingshot with angry birds. And thus ends the chapter one of Journey Down. That was the end? Well, I guess. Well, luckily, I have chapter two. And chapter three is uh, going to be out in, in, uh, in uh, August. Something, August 3rd? And get that! August is my birthday! So, we gotta be playing this, uh, chapter 3, the final chapter, in uh, the journey down around my birthday. And, uh, because the credits of the creators and this awesome game of music, this will be the credits to the video. So, hope you guys enjoyed. And it might be a short video, but hey, we got to see the final bit. Awesome cutscene, worthwhile. Alright, 
So, I guess until I see you guys again, have a great day everyone. belongs to the Makondi people who lived in Tanz Tanzania and Mozambique, Buana and Quito. <laughs> Intro and outro cinematic sketches. Half ink, half digital. This is how most uh, locations in the journey down first came about. Came about. Location thumbnails. They always start small. Count and Dodo's airplane takes shape. Here's a fraction of the logo designs we tried out. A fraction of the logos. Wow. From sketch to cleaned up digital grayscale painting. From sketch fine-tuned and brought to life. Well, as far as life can go. A viewport look at Central Saint Armando 27,000 triangles. This is how Quito looks in wireframe before subdivision. Hey, Quito. Recognize this? I sure do. You had some fun making that little ditty puzzle. And I love that puzzle. It was a good puzzle. And it's the kind of puzzle I can actually do. A look at our editor, Gob Ed, the white points, tint, and shade Buana for fit the scenery. Hmm. The Gob Ed animation editor helps us put everything in place. Most in-game animators run at 15 frames per second. A peek at some of room scripts. Each room has a script file containing all inter interactions available in it. David Dixon, Quito, and Anthony Sardinha, Buona. Ah, very nice. Both just as awesome as IRL and in TJD. So that's Buona, and that's Quito. Nice. Simon D. Souza hanging out with his magical friends. So are you the one that made all this awesome jam and swinging music? Good on you, man. The original soundtrack is available on Bandicam. All proceeds go to awesome ch charities. It is an awesome swinging. I already said it many times, man. It is awesome. I love this accent. I I'm not. I hope I'm pulling it off pretty well. Marcus puts the finishing touches on the end cinematic audio track. Hmm. Matthias showing off the latest progress on his phone. Henrik and Theo's looking stupidly optimistic about the development schedule. Stupidly optimistic? Must have been a very hectic schedule. In Chapter 2, you will explore strange happenings at the Morton's Lighthouse. And uncover secrets hidden in the desert streets of Port Artu. That's all for now. Thanks for playing. Well, that was a little extra for the cha uh, for the video. But you know what? Why not? Let me say goodbye again. Have a great day, everyone.